and the software development we do is a mental exercise it's not a physical exercise and that's why estimating a mental exercise comes with inherent risk guys this is a phone a physical thing and you know how this phone is created it is created in an assembly line where we know that how much time each and every junction in the assembly line will take and that's the precise reason we can tell how many phones we can create in one day in any factory right but before this phone made into the assembly line in a factory it has gone through something what i call it as a mental model okay so somebody might have thought of somebody might have did the research you can consider somebody as teams they had created some models they had created some designs and they had created lots of things before it went into the assembly line so it's easy to predict how much time an assembly line will take but it's very difficult to predict how much time your mental model will take how much time you will take to design the thing you may come up with some reference or you may have some limitations of time but it's very very difficult to determine the amount of time your mental things will take i know you might be wondering what is the relation between assembly line and the topic of this video software estimation you know in this world we do two types of work we always do two types of work one is physical work another is mental work it's very easy to estimate amount of time your physical work will take take any physical work for that matter you can estimate it but for mental work it's very 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 difficult to estimate mental work i know you might be thinking that what it's a bit confusing okay let's go back to our school days we used to learn mathematics right calculus trigonometry pythagoras theorem and many other things right how we used to learn we used to learn the theory we used to do some exercises and for each and every chapter there used to be you know 10 20 exercises and to better understand the chapter we used to do more exercises right now even today is it possible for you to tell that the first exercise which took 5 minutes to solve let's say first calculus exercise the second calculus exercise will take the same amount of time no you can't you know that you have experienced this right as a student we all have experienced this that you know if first problem takes 5 minute second problem may take 2 minute or maybe 2 hours you know sometime we used to struggle in the same calculus or trigonometry problem for hours right before we can get a correct answer remember sometime we used to get plus 7 as a answer and the answer was negative 7 and it took you know 10 to 15 minutes to identify why this is the case that's why your mental exercise mental model is very very difficult to estimate because it totally depends upon what is your mental state at that point of time and you know many other circumstances and the software development we do is a mental exercise it's not a physical exercise and that's why estimating a mental exercise comes with inherent risks and more often than not it's not correct and to make sure that we do things within the time what we are doing we are cutting corners the same thing we used to do in our examinations where you know we know that for solving one problem we have you know 30 minutes of time and if we are not able to solve the problems by 25 26 minutes we used to do something where we can get maximum of the marks if not the full mark for that particular problem right the same thing we do while doing software estimation so you might be thinking that i am saying let's not do any estimate well sorry to disappoint i am not saying this i am trying to say that you know the way we are doing current software estimations is all wrong okay we have to make sure that we do not estimate each and every small small things period there is no purpose that we are going to solve by estimating all the things individually what we should do is something like you know if your examination is having 10 questions and if you have 3 hours time those things should be fixed if you are managed to do all the 10 questions fine if you aren't that is also fine that's not a crime what we are currently doing is that we are making each and every estimation like this will take 5 minutes this will take 10 minutes and if you are not able to do something in 5 minutes it's become a crime 
what I am trying to say is that come up with a conscious decision that okay to solve 10 problems we need approximately 5 hours and it's up to us up to the individual software developers to make sure that whether they take you know 10 minutes in one question or 30 minutes in one question or 10 minutes in another question it's all about what you want to achieve after spending that much time you are not going to achieve just by answering one question in your examination similarly you cannot achieve anything just by doing one piece of work you need to look into things in a bit collective way rather than you know looking into each and every individual things please do not estimate each and everything whatever work you are doing estimate in a rough way the collective things that come out of whatever individual small small things you are doing okay never estimate things like two hours three hours like that it will always gonna take you know more than the estimated time so do not estimate all the small things okay I do hope and believe that you got the gist of what I am trying to tell you. I wanted you to understand the gist of it. I am going to make more videos on this software estimation topic because this is something I want to, you know, do something about it because I know this is one of the most problematic topic and it's very difficult for management personnel to understand what is the meaning of real estimation and the way we are doing things is not correct. It's blatantly incorrect so that's all i wanted to share with all of you today thank you all thanks for watching we will meet again until the next time we meet good day goodbye you take care